Hello everybody, I'm going to show the new strong policy engine in action. What we have is a PostgreSQL database that has data so sensitive that I need to add additional layers of security friction to ensure that data is protected and access is authorized only as needed. I'm gonna to go to the policy library, choose the pre-created policy that I called PostgreSQL IM. I'm going to go in here and I'm going to see that I've already enabled a location and MFA requirement to permit access to this resource, which is the Dev Rocket Lab PostgreSQL database. I've already connected to the database using my StrongDM client and I'm going to go ahead and use my native tool to go and connect to the database. First thing I'm going to be required is an MFA authentication. So I'm going to go to my mobile device, say approve. Yes, that's me. All right. I'm in the database. I'm going to add an additional layer of protection and request access through a manual approval by creating a new statement and clicking on requesting approval. And I'm going to choose an approval workflow called PostgreSQL sensitive data. Hit save. Now I've got two rules in my policy. I'm gonna go back to the database and I am going to select additional error. Okay, now I've been challenged for a manual approval of the workflow. If I go to my Slack client, I'm an approver. I'm gonna go ahead and hit approve for this. Yes, this is an approved request. Okay, I approve of this. Click done. And I'm challenged for an additional layer of security. And I'm there. If I wanted to add even more layers of security, I can enable continuous authorization by adding another policy statement and choosing device trust picking a status for device trust. What this will do is that I will make sure that the user's end device is trusted. And if that user is doing anything that reduces their security posture, then they will be denied access to this database. This is StrongDM Policies in Action.